Hi all, and thanks for watching. In this video, I'm just going to show you how you can improve your edging when using a suite effects, whether it's a reshade with suite effects, an EMB with suite effects, or just suite effects by itself, or how to actually check and make sure that you have the best setting possible in order to get nice clean edges in your game. And what I mean is these rough edges here, they're called aliasing lines, and as you can see, the horizon looks kind of rough there. On the top of the building, you have kind of a rough edge. Along this post, you can make out a rough edge. Now, what we're looking at right here is Fallout New Vegas, and throughout the picture, you can see these rough edges. Now, with your sweet effects, you want to adjust the SMAA line in order to get the best edging possible so that the picture takes away those edges and you get a nice sharp look to the game. As you can see all of those little edges that were here in the previous picture are now pretty much gone. So the picture itself looks a lot nicer and a lot sharper and what you're going to do is you're going to check the SMAA line setting. Now in order to do that you just want to go to the setting file and here I just have a couple setting files that I downloaded and I want to make sure that they're using the best settings possible. Now I don't have all of my setting files optimized at the moment. I will be updating them with these settings but what you want to do is go to the game settings file for the suite effects and check to make sure the SMAA anti-aliasing is on and that the actual settings are set to this here which is the 05 for the threshold the search steps 65 the search steps diag at 16 and the corner rounding at 25 and then your color edge detection set that to 1 and that will give you the nice clean edges like what we're seeing here instead of those rough edges which you see here in the vanilla game. Now I do have the anti-aliasing turned off in the settings for this game and I'm letting the sweet effects actually take care of them as the game actually performs better when you're using the sweet effects anti-aliasing. So if you are using a sweet effects, then try turning off the in-game anti-aliasing and using those settings with the SMAA. Now, this settings file here is one of the 1.51s, and you may actually find that you have a 2.0 settings file if you're using a reshade version as it can use the newer settings files. So if it happens to be a 2.0 then same thing just check and see if the SMAA line is on and then just go down to the SMAA settings and as you can see there's a few more settings here and I have this one set at 06. You can vary it from I'd say 04 to 06 and generally that is about the sharpest that you can get along with the 65, the 16 and 25 although this one has depth threshold so I set that at 21 I'm using the edge detection of 1 and then the extra settings down here in the prediction settings I've set at 1 for the prediction the prediction threshold at 021, the scale at 2, and the strength at 04. And I did test these settings for several hours going on several days in order to determine what the best settings were. And I will be updating my settings files with these settings, but if you are already using one and you want to double check the preset file or the settings file to make sure that it's using the best settings then these are the settings that it should be at in order to get those nice clean edges. Now it won't take away all the rough edges in a game 
but as you can see from the picture that I showed you there it does take away a lot of the rough edges throughout your whole game in order to improve the overall look and if you happen to be making these sweet effects that's one thing you should look at if you're trying to clean up the edgy in a game is the SMAA setting. Now I'm just going to close these up and I'll finish up the video but if there are any questions please let me know in the comments below. Otherwise thanks a lot for watching, take care and I'll talk to you again.